Okay, so hopefully you can see me. The lighting is a little off right now, but I'm sure you can see me. The, um, I checked it, and everything seems to check out okay, and we're just going to roll with it. So what I want to let you know is just because you are aiming for the search engine, that does not mean you don't have to promote and that you don't want to promote via social media. Because how things are, the Google algorithm is much different than it was 10 years ago. You could just throw on some content, put up a blog, and rank in just a few weeks, you know, years ago. But nowadays, Google pay close attention to social signals. A social signal is interaction with blog content, with website content on social media. Because what they're basically saying is, if this content is so great, why aren't people sharing it on Facebook, on Twitter, on LinkedIn, on, on Instagram, wherever? Why, why are people not sharing this blog if it's so great? So that's why I want to throw in this last part of the training. You definitely want to treat your niche blog like a business. Each individual niche blog that you end up having, definitely respect it and treat it each one, treat each one of them like a business because whenever you do that, you are really going to boost your blog and boost it through the roof. I mean, completely skyrocket it. And that's what I love to focus on. I love to focus down on one niche, get it real pumped up and get a lot of juice to that niche blog and then watch it just take off. Watch it really take off and skyrocket. So that's exactly what we are going to do. What I'm going to do right now is just build a fan page with one of my dummy Facebook accounts. Let me go ahead and build a fan page. And you just want to niche target a fan page. Let me just build it up real quick. Sometimes if you're doing copyright stuff like mentioning Photoshop or something, they won't let you do it. So you can get as close as possible like the photography blog or you know just something like that or whatever your niche may be community photoshop blog and let me click continue yeah it's very important it's very very important to create a fan page around your niche blog you want to create a Twitter account around your niche blog. Just everything that you can possibly do in order to get those social signals. Everything that you can possibly do. Okay, it's completely done. And of course, I'll go to Canva and I'll add me a nice little background. I'll, I'll make one. You can easily Google, you know, background images and stuff, but, you know, why do that when you can add the good stuff? You definitely don't want to add no BS when you can add some good stuff. Always, it's always quality. That's what I focus on, quality over everything. Nice photo right there for my Facebook fan page. Let me see. We're good to go right there. Let's go to Canva. Looks good. Let's go log into Canva. Should be already logged in, there we go. We're gonna do a Facebook cover. Canva's super cool. They, they're super cool because they have like layouts for you. Like I, I just clicked on Facebook cover. That's all I did. And I can find a design that I like or I could create one from scratch. I can edit that whole entire Facebook cover photo, YouTube thumbnail or whatever. I can just edit it and, you know, roll with their with their theme and just edit it how I want to. See all of these over here? Just drag it over and edit it if I want to. Let me go ahead and I'll just drag this one over. Even though it's got to do with the beach, you know, people, it'll remind you of vacation. You know, taking photos on vacation, that's what vacation is all about, the memories. I can put the Photoshop, I can put blog right there if I want to. Just something like that. 
If I make a blog a little bigger, I can ungroup it. Photoshop blog. It's good enough for me. And I can download it. And remember, Canva got to upgrade, but you can always just roll with the free version. I was up, upgrading until I found out that I can do everything that I need to do for free. Let's see, that should be downloaded. Upload photo video. Okay, there's our nice banner. Save it. And of course, what you want to do, blog looks very good and very professional if you ask me. So what you want to do right now is you want to begin to promote individual posts on your fan page. So you don't want to just put, I don't want to just put the Photoshop blog.club or whatever my URL may be. I just don't want to copy and paste that link. I want to get individual posts. So let's go to the blog. I believe I chose dot club. Let me make sure. Should be dot club. There we go. So what I want to do is I want to simply grab a post right here. And I want to copy that post. And I want to share it. I want to share that post, that individual link. Let me see. And when I do, a nice beautiful image along with my nice title will pop up like that. I can just put a nice description if I want to. I put this is it finally Photoshop CS6 free get instant access before it's too late and I can share that post okay there's two ways you can start to get interaction well there's multiple ways you can get start getting interaction to your blog post one way of course just going here and boosting post and boosting your post for five dollars per day just targeting people that's into whatever niche you may be in another thing you can do is simply, and I went over this month too a lot, is simply post things. You don't want to post, um, share no links. You want to only share photo content when you're using this method. Let's say we are sharing this photo right here. Just sharing a photo or, you know, anything niche related, any kind of photo that's niche related. Let's say I'm just sharing it. And I just put my, you know, I put my description right here. And I want to share now. Another thing what I can do to start getting people over to my fan page and pulling people over organically is simply click and share right there. And I can share in a group. That's all I got to do. I just have to be a part of niche related groups. I can share into the groups and people will see that they will see that it was shared from my fan page. So they will say, okay, I love this image. Let's see what else they got going on. They will come to the fan page. They will do one of the two things. They will either like the page or they will leave the page without liking. So if you can get so many people a day, let's say 10, 15, 20 people a day, liking your brand new fan page, your, listen, what will happen? Your blog post that you also have posted on your fan page will begin to catch traction and it will begin to be like a snowball effect of people coming onto your fan page, clicking through on your blog post, checking out your blog post, and of course, checking out your call to action to what they, you know, to what they came there for anyways and what they're they're interested in anyways. So that is the whole entire chain reaction. It's all a domino effect when it comes to using this method and getting people over to your fan page. Remember, you can always do a $5 per day, $5 to $10 per day boost to really boost things. But if you want to do it for free, you can do it, of course, by sharing into groups like I talked about in month two. So the bottom line is, 
Social signals are everything. You can make a fan page, like I was just telling you, you can make a Twitter account, you can make a um, Reddit is great. You can go to micro workers and have people share for you, you know, share on social media for you. And you know, I've talked about micro workers a lot. You can just do all of it when it comes to social, because when it comes to a lot of people telling you to tell you to focus on one network at a time, but when it comes to building backlinks and social signals to a brand new website, you need to be everywhere you can possibly be. I mean, even if you've never heard of certain social networks, you can research them and find them and share your blog post on those networks also. And what we are doing is what we are focused on is we're focusing on social signals. We're not really we're not really focused on it going viral on Facebook. That that's not the whole entire intention. That's not the goal. The goal is to get those social signals, show Google that we're actually worth something and get that juice to our blogs so they will boost the rankings because they see how important it is because when I share on social media, somebody might come to my Facebook page, they might share it to their page and so on and it's proven to Google that our site is worth the bump and that's how all of this works. So that is the end of this part of the training. All of the training as you can see was super simple but it's so effective. Because search engines are your best friend. Everybody always complain about Google changing the algorithm and everything. But let me tell you something. Let me tell you a site that's never going anywhere. And that's Google.com. You definitely want to be within Google if you can be within Google. And being within Google with something like CPA offer, something where you don't have to sell to make money, your, your, your life will be good forever. You know, for, for years to come, you will be good to go. Because even if you're making an extra $30 a month with Google searching and traffic, guess what? You're not spending no money on ads. You're not working on that, that site or that blog anymore. And you're just sitting back, relaxing, collecting money. That's exactly how searching and traffic works. Once you are ranked there and people are sharing it organically and you're not even paying attention to it no more, basically like to set it and forget it, method how it works overall once you are collecting that money you can move on to another blog and another blog and even before you even start collecting money you can start you you can set up multiple blogs and just check back in a month to see how good you are ranking how good some of your other blogs are ranking and you can just kind of just go from blog to blog to see which one is picking up the most which one you are ranking best with and which one is going to bring you the most traffic and make you the most money and that's the whole entire goal super excited to have you watch the last part of the training I'm so excited to see each and every one of your blogs up and running to see the back the backlinks coming in the social signals and just to see everything overall that you have going on definitely excited to have you join me in the next month of the training because this stuff is not going to stop but always remember to always, always, always focus on what's forever, and that is Google searching the traffic.